Welcome back to the shooting channel and today we're going to have a slightly different film. I'm going to sit down and I'm going to talk to you about the Olympic Games. Because we've just had probably the most fantastic thing could ever happen in our sport. Nathan Hales wins Olympic gold and Olympic trap and Amber Hill the probably the most famous person in the shooting world wins Olympic silver at Olympic ski. Now the reason why I love Olympic, the Olympic discipline so much is because I remember I shot double track myself and I started when I was 10 years old. The Olympic disciplines is the pinnacle of our sport. And this is where we as the shooting organisations or the shooting community needs to support the Olympic disciplines more than sporting. In the sporting world, we don't have the, the coverage. We don't have the world championships. We don't have any of that. In the Olympic disciplines, we have the coverage. We have the BBC coverage. We have the power to make our sport great. Now, I can remember Amber Hill when she first started, going back when she was 10 years old, I've even got her first gun that she ever shot. And she was probably the best advocate for our sport from when, we were really, when she was really young. A young female, very girly girly, and she won't mind me saying that, and she has now gone to winning Olympic silver. But how much effort does it take to doing that. We had Richard Folds, Sydney 2000. Before that, we had Bob Braithwaite. We then had Peter Wilson in London 2012. And we've had lots of Steve Scott. We've had lots of silver medals and bronze medals afterwards. Ian Peel. But it's the effort that it takes to do that. And I'm going to be completely honest, people really, they don't remember the people that actually try. I can think of hundreds of people that were going all around the selection shoots, trying, putting thousands and thousands of shells down that gun and money. With the best win in the world, it costs an absolute fortune just to get to the selection shoots, to the GB selection shoots. Once somebody does get that, we've got to support them. We've got to push them out there because it helps the whole sport. It doesn't just help the Olympic disciplines. It helps game shooting. It helps sporting. It absolutely helps us get our sport out there to the big world world. And this is my frustration with the shooting community. We've got the CPSA, which is to technically our governing body of the sport. But they are official governing body of the sport, but they don't push us out there. You've got BASC, which argumentatively is probably the biggest organisation out there. And they have 250,000 members. They are at every single country fair. They are at every single event outside of our shooting world. And the CPSA, they're not out there enough. And this is what we've got to change in our sport. We've got to change the sport from the inside out. And we've got to tell our organisations to get out there. The CPSA, yes, they put loads of money into the British Open, the English Open, but they don't go to the local country show or county show and push the sport out there. And that's what needs to happen. That's where the money needs to be spent. So for the next four years, let's try and change the organisations. The biggest organisations to change is CPSA and the Gun Trade Association, because they've got to get the Gun Trade Association and the CPSA are what people look at from the outside world. And we've got to get it out there. My biggest thing I did, I've given seven cars away to kids. And that's what's, it's a wow factor. Giving a car away. I can always remember when Beth, when Tom Scott won their first car. Now Beth has now gone on to winning world championships. Beth Norton is probably one of the greatest young shots in the world as we speak now. But we've got to get that. And, and they all came from the school's challenge. Now, how do we get more of that big sponsorship? A kid winning a car, that's a wow factor. Not an adult winning a Range Rover, that's not a big wow factor. We need to get more wow factors in our sport. So comment below, I'd love to hear your thoughts. I think the best thing has ever happened to this sport is Nathan Hales and Amber Hill with what they've done. Amber's got her own cartridges. 
So let's see, comment below. What can we do as a sport? I'd love to hear your comments to get us out there in the mainstream media. Let's help. Comment below, I want to hit, I want this program pushed out there to everyone to get our sport out there in the mainstream media. Just because we're using a gun, it doesn't make any difference. It's a piece of sports equipment. But that is the only way we are gonna fight all the politics, bad politics that's going on in our sport. The licensing, the, the fact that there's a lot of anti-gun people out there. We've got to change our sport and we've got to use Paris Olympics to change our sport and get ourselves out there. I hope you've enjoyed this, this film and I hope you thought it's not too controversial. I've tried to say what I think and put it out there and this is what more people think. Please like us on Facebook, follow us on Instagram, don't forget hit that subscribe button, it really helps us to give you content like this. Thank you for watching and we'll see you on the next one.